So what is an invasive species? Actually, let's define a few things. First, native species, species that have become part of an ecosystem through natural processes. Second, non-native species or introduced species, species found outside of their normal range because of human activity that do not pose a threat to their new home. And finally, invasive species, species found outside of their normal ranges that have a negative impact on other organisms, including humans, ow, or environments. They tend to have escaped controlling species like predators, herbivores, or parasites in their normal ranges, which would have otherwise limited their survival, and they are often well-suited to their new environment. Invasive species include any kind of living organism, plant, insect, fish, fungus, bacteria, or even an organism's seeds or eggs, anything that does not originally belong to an area. Why are invasive species a threat? Well, invasive species can do all sorts of damage to an existing ecosystem, including changing habitats and starving native animals of food and resources, a major threat to biodiversity. They can cause or contribute to habitat degradation, the loss of native fish, wildlife, plant, and tree species, a decrease in recreational opportunities and income, along with crop damage, diseases in humans and livestock. <gasps> they also cost the U.S. billions of dollars each year between loss of goods, land, and cost of management. So what can we concerned citizens do about it? We can plant native in our landscaping and our gardens. We can practice play, clean, go by cleaning our boots, gear, and pets before and after recreating to get rid of hitchhiking seeds and pathogens. We can practice clean, drain, dry when boating, cleaning our boats thoroughly before transporting them to different bodies of water. We can avoid packing a pest when traveling by not moving firewood, cleaning bags and boots after hikes, and disposing of food before traveling from place to place. And we can volunteer at our local parks, refuges, or other wildlife areas to help remove invasive species, as well as help educate others about the threat, like by sharing this video. That concludes our class for today. Now go forth and spread your newfound knowledge.